Well, hello everybody. Hi. This is over the hills with our two under the hills friends. <laughs> Beth and over Afra. the hill. Over. <laughs> over. <laughs> and this weekend we're going to hike part of the San Diego Trans County Trail from Ranchita, where we started, uh, to Cuyamaca Lake. So it's about 36 miles, I think it was. Yeah. Mostly yeah. downhill. Uh, well, no. <laughs> okay. minus the 3,000 uh, Yeah, it would be mostly downhill if we didn't take into account of two and a half thousand feet of uphill to clear back the lake. So Ice cream tomorrow. Beautiful weather. Woohoo! So lucky. Yeah. So let's see what this trail oh. has in store. Happy now. Oh, like it twice. Yeah, but we didn't buy them. It wasn't a very good deal. It's like a chandelier plant. Well, oh, that's the other way. So is that kind of rock? That's the benchmark. Oh, it's a beautiful day out here. This is Palomar. Oh yeah, see the dome on Palomar. Okay. I think that's what we did on John's hit, was hit that was one of the destinations. Mm. Oh, and the wind's died down. Very nice. Mm, beautiful. Yeah, it's good to be out in the desert again, huh? First time since finishing the Arizona Trail in October. Well, here we got to be looking at the lookout tower up on Vulcan Mountain. Let's zoom in for a closer look. No, that was, that was in the so here's Stuart Spring. Um, lots of bees here. Yeah, it'd be hard. Why well, are they bees? I'm not sure. Might be hard to get the water there. But it's flowing nicely. Which looks promising for otter flam also. Huh. Nice, huh? Beautiful. And just across the way from Stuart Spring is a really nice camp spot. Yeah, perfect. Water and everything. Welcome, you're in a sensitive archaeological area that holds special meaning for the descendants of the people who lived here in times past. Help us, prote help us protect and preserve these fragile and easily damaged resources that are part of California's cultural heritage. Oh, I'm being left behind. Welcome to Angelina Spring Cultural Preserve. Oh, my terrors. Parking. The Grand Canyon Road. Oh, yeah. We have to go the look. On the way to Angelina Spring. Let's see if we can find it. Let's see if there's water there. Yeah, well, in our search for Angelina Spring, we get an A for effort, <coughs> but an F for finding it. Uh, oh, spring. <laughs> yeah, well, it's probably right next to the road. Let's see, Beth disappeared in the brush. Oh, well, there she is. Good thing we had plenty of time today. <laughs> Make it look good, Beth. Oh, he said, oh, this is easy. We follow a trail. <laughs> no, no, don't say that. Martin might be listening. <laughs> well, here's a rock with a bunch of bedrock morteros. 
Indian and Acorn grinding holes. Pretty deep too. These must have been used for centuries. So, welcome to Angelina Spring if you can find it. Good luck. Fires and camping permitted in authorized areas only. But What's an authorized area? Spring, we don't know. Oh, there is that rock. Packing it up here. <laughs> the scariest part of today's hike. Crossing Highway 78. But we made it. Why did the hike us cross the road? No water though. Not like last time. <laughs> yeah, we cash water here. Uh, it's just gone five o'clock and the sun's beginning to set. Some nice sunset light over there. And here comes Shorty, Beth and Afra. Nice time of day. It was a very nice day today. Alrighty. Well, after an early start, I mean, it starts out okay. So. We're at the main entrance to Plum Canyon, and here's our group of happy hikers. Where's the sun? Yeah, where's the sun? <laughs> there comes Afra. Here comes Afra. There she is. Followed by Shortcut. On the Trans County Trail, and there's Granite Mountain. <laughs> And looking into Earthquake Valley, Shelter Valley, as it's also named. After a shortish detour to the stagecoach RV in place to get water and second breakfast, we just picked up the riding and hiking trail again. Well, I say we, but we really come. Granite Mountain over there. And there's Patsy, Afra, and Beth. Huddle. <laughs> well, it's a good thing there's a trail through here because there's a lot of joya. Good thing for the trail, huh? There she comes. <laughs> joya paradise. <laughs> Gotta watch where you walk. Yeah. We just popped over Foot and Walker Pass. And well, I think it was down the road a little bit. And looking into Blur Valley. Yay! Beautiful day. It's a little on the warm side now, actually. Hot. Hot. <laughs> now we get to work across Blur Valley. But, let's see. Oh, we got the gaggle, the posse behind me. Walking along Box Canyon, where the Mormon Battalion came. 
It's actually hard going in here with the soft sand. Oh. Mormon's Italian trail marker. Oh, Through Box cool. Canyon. Oh, Here's yeah, Afra. But Afra isn't a Mormon. <laughs> Let's see. Shortcut isn't a Mormon either. And I'm not a Mormon. Here's one of the scary parts of the backpack crossing the road. There's oncoming traffic. <laughs> like we made it. Yeah, scariest part of the backpack. Now we're going up Vallecito Wash. Soon we'll be heading into Oriflam. And yeah, hopefully there's water. <laughs> nice day there. Ooh, Oriflam Canyon. Uh, here's our camp in Oriflam Canyon. Very nice. There's water down in the stream below. And now we got to go for the ritual foot washing. Not quite as good as Japan, but what can you do? Miniature Inca ruins here in Oriflam Canyon. Let's see where this goes. Oh, yeah. Pretty nice campsite. So, this might be better than where we're camped. Have a look. Yeah. There's our tent. Sun's going down. Not going to be long now. Quarter to seven in the morning, looking down into Oriflam Canyon. And we came up this Mason Valley truck trail. And we're coming up it. And beautiful morning again. Oh, the ridge line. Nice time of day. Good to see the NRA is protecting our rights to shoot up the signs. But better signs than people. Here we go, heading towards the Lagunas and the PCT crossing. We're climbing out of the Laguna Crest and that snow-covered mountain in the distance. And that must be San Gregorio. Good thing there's a clear path here. Truck trail. Awfully brushy otherwise. Well, there's a water outlet near the top of the grade, but I checked it, no water there. Yeah, we got plenty of water. And yeah, it's nice. Snow on Gorgonia, a little snow on Jacinto. Looking over to the Santa Rosa Ridge there, it's Toro Peak. Zoom in on Toro. There's Toro. And then over to the right there. Coming into the middle of the picture now is Rabbit Peak. 
Yeah, great. And I'm at the wind here. Oh, there's that one. Of the water tank. Here comes Shortcut and Beth looking over to Granite Mountain. We met a PCG class of 2018 hiker yesterday, and his plan was to climb Granite Mountain yesterday. There's a nice California riding and hiking trail paralleling the PCT for a while, maybe a mile or less. And here comes Shortcut. Yay. Nice day, huh? Birdies are happy. <laughs> Toro Peak and Afra. <laughs> North Peak, Cuyamaca Lake, Middle Peak, and Stonewall Peak. There's Cuyamaca Lake and North Peak. And we're going to eat lunch at the restaurant by the lake. Ooh. So we should be able to see. Somewhere over there. Yeah, this is a bit of a boggy swamp. Let's see if Beth can make it. I usually let the women go first, but it didn't look too bad, so I took a chance. Ooh. Perfect. <laughs> and here's Afra. This is just a wee taste of Scotland. Jump or swim? Uh, I'll use the bridge. This is the bridge. I was just telling Beth, I usually let the women go first as a courtesy, but this looks fairly easy. This is the bridge? Yes, that's the bridge. <laughs> you can do it. I did it. Beth did it. Slippery. Meanwhile, Patsy decided to try and look over the dam, but we don't even know if it's open. So, Afra's looking a bit unstable, but she made it. All right. Mm -hmm. 